Hi boys and girls, it's me your host Sofia Eliana and this is the gaming talk show number 9. Let's go! Well, if someone living in a box and doesn't know that there was a BlizzCon 2016, what brings us a lot of good news, so let's see what there was. Diablo 1 will be resurrected but in a body of Diablo 3. Blizzard created a special event, the Darkening of Freeze Room, which will be available in Diablo 3 Public Test Realm next week. So basically you will be able to play in Diablo 1 when you're playing in Diablo 3. Inception! Hope Blizzard will bring Leonardo DiCaprio into the game also. As for me, looks cool. Everything connected to the games look cool for me. I'm a nerd. So it's a good idea to people who never played in a Diablo first chapter. So these people will be able to try it in Diablo 3. And also guys, new class in Diablo 3. Necromancer. I guess those who played in Diablo 2 will be happy to see it. This amazing class back into the game. Sombra, the first hero with invisibility in Overwatch. I predict nerfs is coming and a lot of QQ on forums. But what we know about this hero? There is some kind of gameplay trailer and short movie about her. Well, she's a tricky girl who wished to play on a both sides. In the same time, if you know what I mean. But what I can say, great that new hero in Overwatch is for free because I'm going to play with her a lot. Also in Overwatch will be a new brawl and other little cosmetic updates. Big updates in the Heroes of the Storm. Ragnaros and Warrior Green soon will be added to the game. Ragnaros look amazing. His great defensive class and in the video showing some amazing skills. For example, he can get over the structure and defend it with his body. Also, Warrior Ring is cool because he gets free specs like real warrior. Also added a new game modes and skins for your transport and heroes. Well, I remember on a previous BlizzCon was announced some kind of arena for Heroes of the Storm. Where it is, Blizzard? And this week, Mr. Boscat is seeking for your help. He's participated in a Ubisoft competition, what is called Watchdog Film Fest. He made a small movie about the hackers and phones. You can see the preview now here, but he's asking you to vote for him on this web page that you can see now. And there you can see the full movie of it. I hope guys you will help Mr. Bosket and you will vote for him. A guy from Russia, city Yekaterinburg, is now a world champion in the Hearthstone game. In game nickname Pavel is new Hearthstone world champion. After defeating Artem Kravitz, who is Dr. Hippie, so he takes home $250,000. Pavel is only 18 years old, so let's see what we have now. Number one guild in a wolf is Russian. Hearthstone champion is Russian. Russian takes games so serious, I guess. Except Overwatch. And now our special heading Russian Round the World. And this week Russian Round the World will be Pilmeni. Pilmeni translated as a meat dumplings. Let's try it guys. Pilmeni. Girls big lips called Pilmeni. I'm really good at cooking Pilmeni. Pilmeni is the best food for a keyboard sportsman. And this week comment is... So yeah guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to put thumbs up and subscribe on my channel and I really hope that together we will help Mr. Boscat to win or to have some votes at all. So yeah, don't forget to put your likes and I love you all! Bye guys! Mwah!